A rectangular solid is a three-dimensional solid with six rectangular faces, as shown here. On the left, we see a typical rectangular solid, and on the right, a transparent one, where we can see the back sides of the solid with the dotted lines. Now, the lines that make up a rectangular solid are called edges. Places where the lines meet are called vertices, singular vertex. And here, we can see one face of a rectangular solid. Now, rectangular solids have six faces, 12 edges, and eight vertices. And keep in mind that there are three faces of potentially different size. The fact that the dimensions of a rectangular solid may not be identical inform the way we think about surface area and volume. Here, we can see the three dimensions of the rectangle marked with an L, a W, and an H for the length, the width, and the height. When we compute the surface area, our formula looks like this. 2L times W plus 2L times H plus 2W times H. That's because two faces of this rectangle have the dimensions L and W, in this rectangle the top and bottom, two have the dimensions L and H, the front and back, and two have the dimensions W and H, the two sides of the rectangle. Volume is computed by multiplying length times width times height.